Hello my dear friends, this is a painty cat. My name is Catherine. Today we are gonna continue mini serial about a tiger and this time it's gonna be a portrait. We will continue those uh, line of the tutorials about uh, symbols of the year in a king outfit. We started with the year of the mouse and uh, also the previous one, it was the year of the ox. So both uh, tutorials you can find uh, on a channel and also the real-time versions on a Patreon. I really, really recommend to check them before this one because here we're gonna continue and uh, also we're gonna change some elements uh, and practice some new techniques. We're starting kind of similar compared to previous um, portraits. It's a vertical brush strokes, a white brush and this type of underpainting la layer giving us ability to create very interesting, not flat uh, background, which is important for the portrait. I don't like just black or umber, you know, sometimes it's looking a little bit boring. This time I also wanna add maybe leaves, palm leaves, and it will give an interesting detail to the tiger, just you know, those atmosphere are for this animal. About face, about the head of a tiger, uh, here we're gonna continue work with uh, the roll of the tape, same as we did before, but also just want to remind you, if you don't want to follow the steps, you can find traceable on my Patreon. Just follow link down below and uh, print it before you will start to paint. About uh, how long tutorial going? Well, um, it's kind of complicated painting scenery because uh, we have so many elements. It's a portrait first, so face, yes. Also, it's an outfit with a kind of interesting color. It's a uh, ermine with those little black tails. And uh, we're gonna practice fun brush. I think uh, tools can give a lot if uh, you want to paint some specific texture, you want to create some specific uh, texture as a for, for example. Uh, same brushes we can use for the grass, so this time it will be just a little different tricks uh, for the color and also for the brush. Yes, I already mentioned this one in a previous tutorial, a uh, rainbow tiger. Here, if you want to create very detailed fur, I can highly recommend this kind of a brush. And just to want to remind you, it's a brush, uh, one of a set. It's a set of 12 brushes. And there, fork brush included. I, to be honest, rarely could see this specific shape brush as a single one at the store. Well, as you can see, we're going step by step, but uh, please uh, remember on a YouTube, I usually uh, am making demonstration versions of tutorials. They are kind of short and here you can find all the main steps you will need to follow in a real time. Real time going one hour and 40 minutes. Yes, it's long, but again, it's not that complicated. In general, just so many steps need to be done, you know. I really hope you will find this one interesting and even if you will not follow the whole of it, uh, hopefully you will find some interesting ideas here for your own creativity. Thank you very much for joining me here and thank you for watching.
our painting done so it's just few final brush strokes to create maybe more interesting highlights on the leaves and we're done my friends this tutorial kind of complicated but remember if you will go step by step from general to specific everything possible to create also, if you want to paint it step by step with me with detailed comments about steps, color mixing, brushes, color techniques, just follow my Patreon. We're done with this one, but the next tutorial will close this mini serial about tigers of this year, so be sure to subscribe and don't miss it we will create more realistic tiger that time if you like this painting thumbs up and uh, i hope uh, to meet you soon on my next videos it was a painting cat bye bye <laughs>